All right, so now we're gonna have a look at the very common and kind of uncomfortable world of side control defense. So a lot of people um, focus on escaping side control, which is good, but preventing people from settling um, inside control is even better, right? So the arm that wants to grab your head is really the arm that we want to be focusing on and make sure it doesn't grab my head, right? So we'll have a look at the, the various stages of it. So, So there's a nice little idea to, um, that I, I consider side control defense. It's not escaping side control as such. It's really looking at preventing the, the grips and holds that the person wants to have on you so that they don't get an optimum position. And I try and avoid as best I can to have anything between their hands. Like if I have an arm between their hands, they can attack that. If my head's on there, they can attack that. So by passing the arm to the other side, it means that there's nothing really between their hands that they can attack and submit me with. They're going to have to trans transition to the mount to have a better chance of, of attacking me, and I have a counter for that. 